What's up YouTube, it's Adam from I'm a Music Mogul. In today's video I'm going to show you how to use region automation in Logic Pro 10.1. Here is the region that we will be adding automation to. And we're going to apply a classic EDM effect slash automation to this region. So I'm just going to bring in a single band EQ. EQ, single band EQ, stereo. And we're going to change my EQ mode to high cut. And we're going to automate the cutoff frequency right here. So to get something like that. To activate our automation, all we have to do is hit A on our keyboard, and it activates right here. By default, the track automation is set. And in this case, we don't want to use track automation, we want to use region automation. So every time we move this region, the automation will carry with it nicely and cleanly. So I'm just going to click this once, and that changes to region. Click it back, it goes back to track. But in this tutorial, we're talking about region automation. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to open up my automation settings right here. I'm going to go to single band EQ and I'm going to go to frequency because that's what I want to automate. Of course, we can always automate using our mouse or external controller, but in this case, I'm just going to quickly draw in my automation using my mouse. So let's just add a dot here, add a dot here, bring this down. And let's say we want it to start building up halfway in the loop. Let's hear how that sounds. All right, so that sounds about right. The reason why we want to use region automation, because let's say this happens a couple times throughout our track, and we need to just basically copy it to the next section. And it's really simple, because all you have to do is copy the track, and the automation will copy with it. So if I hit A on my keyboard, you'll see that the automation has been copied. If you work with track automation, it kind of gets sloppy and sometimes you don't copy over the automation and it becomes a mess. With region, you're always safe and you can always feel comfortable that your automation will be carrying with your region. And that is something that is uh, really welcomed in the new Logic Pro 10 update. If you have any questions on this, you can ask me in the comment section below. For more great videos, remember to subscribe as they're always coming. And I'll see you all in the next video. Later, guys. Peace.